Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Skynet with another video tutorial here. Uh, today, I'm gonna show you the uh, rules, uh, the firewall rules for your uh, PF Sense. If you're having problem with your Xbox or your PS5 uh, connecting to games, uh, I was having this problem. Uh, I was playing Call of Duty. I have uh, I was playing Call of Duty uh, with my son. I have two Xbox uh, connected on my network, and we were playing uh, for five minutes, eight minutes, or a match. We were playing uh, okay, and then but we were getting a lot of uh, that's connection to the server. So, and in order to fix that, I I had to do I had to add firewall rules to my PSN router. Uh, as you see, I don't use any more, uh, I don't use any more, uh, router anymore, any regular router. So, <clears throat> uh, so this is what I do. First of all, you need to log in, whatever your IP address is on your, uh, on your fire, uh, uh, your PFSense router. So I believe this, this setting works on PFSense. And OPN Sense because OPN Sense is a fork of PF Sense. So, in order for you, whatever IP address you just log into your IP uh, uh, through your PF Sense, then you gotta go to uh, Firewall and on Firewall you gotta go to NAT in order for you to add those rules. So, you gonna go here outbound and so by default, by default, PF Sense, it comes, it comes connect, uh, it comes click here. It comes like it comes smart to this mode, uh, automatic outbound NAT rule generation IPsec pass through included. So this is the default setting for uh, PF Sense. So what I did, I just change it to hybrid outbound NAT rule generation automatic outbound NAT plus rule below so and then I click click save once you once you remove it once you change it from uh, automatic to hybrid outbound net then click save once you save it then go here to the uh, upper arrow where it says add so you gonna add here the rules I'm not gonna do it because I already did it uh, in it's already set up for me and working so uh, what I'm gonna do here, I'm just gonna go just show you and edit the mapping setting. So here it is. That's the outbound net. So here on the inner on the interface interface is gonna be one. It's always gonna be one. So address family is IPv4 plus IPv6. My uh my ISP support IPv6 as well my modem. So if you don't, if your ISP doesn't support IPv uh, IPv6, so you all you do is just click IPv4. Or if your internet provided just support IPv6, you click IPv6. But I have both of them enabled. So then protocol on protocol you're gonna click any. You're gonna click any, and then source source it all depends on how many ports your uh your pfn router comes with so source for example i i try i try this firewall network one subnet and LAN, and it, it didn't work so i was i was struggling to find a solution for it but for me it works network or aliases that's what uh that's what it worked for me. So just do either network if your PF Sense router is only comes it only has network, so you're gonna pick network. Or if it comes network or aliases, you're gonna uh, alias, you're gonna pick that up. And here you're gonna type your your Xbox or your PS5 IP address. Followed by the 32 uh here because by default it's 24 if you leave it on 24 it's gonna be you it's gonna be uh not i believe not the specifier for um 
every device connected on your network that requires net uh, net capability. So you're gonna do this your IP address uh, of your Xbox. For uh, my Xbox, this is my IP address of my Xbox. For yours, it might be different. Uh, so please make sure you check your Xbox IP address. This is my Xbox IP address, 10.1.1.11, and then followed by the 32. So 32, and this is pointed to the Xbox IP address. And then destination, destination is gonna be any. So make sure you click any. And translation, translation address is gonna be LAN, uh, because my, uh, Xbox is connected to the LAN network. For example, if you have multiple uh, multiple port, you're gonna pick up the port according, accordingly. So uh, for me, it's LAN. My son is OPT2 because I have two Xbox on my network. So for me, I'm gonna leave it LAN. Like I said, it, for you, for your case, it might be different. You have to pick your port accordingly, as I mentioned. So I'm gonna leave it at land. Here in port, port or range, uh, make sure you click. Don't do anything here, but you click. Make sure you click. Check mark a static port. If you don't check static port, it's not gonna work. So then, at the bottom, here give it a description. If you have multiple Xbox or PS5, you give it a descriptions uh, accordingly. Like me, I have two Xbox. Uh, both of them are Xbox One. So here I put Xbox One, and then NAT. Dash. Uh, I mean, I give it a space Xbox One space that NAT, and then click save. And then once you click save, uh, you come back to uh, NAT. Uh, you come back here, and then make sure you save everything. And it's gonna look like this. Your setting has to look like this. This is my uh, my son uh, Xbox IP address, and this is mine here. So, uh, so this is he. See how the difference. I mean, it's just the same one on letters, and then one on as as number. And then here I did it all capital letters, and here uh, just the capital X and I, I so to differentiate which one is mine and which one is is so after that and click save everything here and save and make sure you reboot your Xbox and your uh your PFNs router as well make sure you reboot everything before uh going back online into the games like I said we were having issues like for a long time I was it was stressful and you know, until like I decided to do uh, some research on the PFN's uh, uh, handbook or the guides until I found but it wasn't showing much of it you know so but I that's what I I start messing around with it until I found I found out that uh, the correct setting so your in it's gonna look like this. It's gonna be interface it's gonna be one, and source is gonna be your PS5 I, your PS5 IP address. It, it could be a PS5, Xbox, or even your computer, if you play on computer. Source port is gonna be any. It's the the stars mean any destination port any and any. That address. This is LAN address over here. Like I said, I have two Xbox. So it has to be either whatever port your Xbox or your PS5 or your computer is connected to. And this is not port any static port because you're giving a static port to the IP address of your device and Xbox and give it a description so you don't get confused. And then now I'm going to show you on my Xbox that now it shows moderate on the uh, when I turn it on. See, I'm turning on my Xbox and I'm going to show you uh, now that it shows moderate the NAD uh, type on my Xbox.
that's loading up. It's an old Xbox One S, so it's taking a while. So, okay, so well, we're gonna go to settings. We're gonna go to general and then I'm gonna go network and see uh see now how it shows okay so not type it's moderate what it says moderate before for me it was a strict and believe me it was a streak that was on like red lettering or sometimes was showing streak on like gray grayish uh, letters so now it says moderate which is it's just fine and then i can check my, my not type here see it looks like you're type not at moderate and then i can test the game and sometimes it shows that it's open, which is it. It works uh, accordingly to the Xbox what what they require, uh, what the Xbox is re requiring to that uh, to open the NAT port. So look, looks like your NAT type is open right now, so it, which is good. And then that's it. And I'm gonna show you the. Uh, I'm gonna go to bands one. See, it say NAT. Not type it's open because automatically, like I said, Xbox is requesting for the net type. So I'm gonna go to advance and that's see, that's my see the same IP address. That's my IP address for my Xbox and my DNS as well. But this is about my I uh my uh net being strict on the xbox so see that's the xbox address that i added there and then the port so i changed i tried everything changing the port selecting every port and it didn't it didn't work so what it works it was just me selecting the uh the firewall rules on my pfsn uh router so see i'm gonna show you one more time that's my uh ip uh my ip address of my xbox and then i'm gonna go in my computer and show you my xbox uh ip address on the on the uh, firewall rules so see that's my ip address for my fi uh, for my xbox so like i said just uh if you're having problems yeah hey please just hit me up on, on youtube uh all I ask in return, like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And uh, that's all I can say. Thank you for watching.